I seem to be cursed. Well, why do I always get the pupils who think they're the exceptions to the rule? Master Silvarte, it's true that our Padawans are acting a bit strangely. But I don't think there's cause for concern. Wait, I have an idea. You, Padawan, I know you. I'm sorry, Master. Are you talking to me? Yes. It's what I usually do when I wish an audience with someone. Master Silvarte is concerned about a couple of our Padawans. He suspects that they are, well... If I'm correct, they are following their passions down a dark path. Am I to understand that love leads to the dark side? Emotions disrupt balance. When you hold one person in higher regard than others, it clouds clarity and twists reason. We mustn't stand by. In all other aspects, these two are model pupils, but I agree we would be remiss if we didn't do what we can to settle the issue. They may be more open and revealing with a student like you. We need you to confront them and discover if they are indeed cultivating a romance. And basically to become a glorified snoop, then. You're helping the Order root out the seeds of darkness. There's no task more important. Their names are Morrison and Spanios. As we speak, they are in the ruins of Lower Caleth. So go, talk with them, and report back what you discover about their relationship. Try not to alert or alarm them. If they are in love, they are sure to be volatile. You found it! Well done, Morrison! Oh, Spanios, I couldn't have done it without you. You're amazing. I don't care what the Masters say, we're proving everyone wrong. Come here and give me a kiss. Go ahead. Plant one on him. I would. He's cute. Who are you? This isn't what you think it is. You have nothing to worry about. I'm a friend. Oh, really? You say you're a friend. Does that mean you're not here to blow the whistle on our romance? Spanios, you just confirmed the truth to this person. I'm sorry, my love, but I'm sick of hiding. The order is wrong. Fear, not emotion, is the adversary of the Jedi way. Ironically, the Masters fear emotion, and therefore, they deny us its bounty. The power of our love is why we work so well together. Our teamwork allowed us to find this rare lightsaber crystal. So our passion actually strengthens the Order. Maybe you're right, but it's not for me to decide. Spanius. Please help me convince this upstart not to expose us. I love you, Morrison. And so if you believe we must remain hidden, I honor that. But it may take a sacrifice. You mean the crystal? I agree, my love. Friend, if you tell the Masters we're not romantically involved, we'll give you this powerful crystal for your future lightsaber. Would that buy your silence? That sounds pretty good to me. But I'm not sure I can trust you. Don't fear. I will keep my word. If you tell the Masters you found nothing suspicious here, come back to us, and we'll give you the crystal. Don't you dare try to fool us. We will know if you do. Were you successful, Padawan? Did you find our pupils in the ruins? Tell us, what did you uncover about the nature of Spanius and Morrison's relationship? Are they romantically involved? I discovered that there is no romance between them, Masters. You see, Master Silvarte, your concerns were for naught. I am relieved to hear this. Surprise, but most relieved. You have handled this matter with great character. The Order is fortunate to have you in the fold. That's all well and good, but am I excused? I'm sorry if you feel put upon, youngster. Now that you've befriended them, you might check in on our students. Otherwise, good luck with the rest of your training. Well, our blackmailer returns. Back for the crystal, no doubt. Thank you for keeping our secret. Just hand it over and we can be done with this. Blood sucker. You got what you wanted, my sweet. It's a small price to pay. Don't mind her. Good luck to you. Hold on to that lady, Spanios. She's a keeper. I sure think so. Here's the crystal. Goodbye, friend.